We got our water hooked up. We're gonna fill up our tanks. We have an 88 gallon fresh water tank um, And that lasts us about every 10 days. So as you can see, this is the white hose from earlier And we have about 200 feet to get to our water source um, The area which we're staying does not have frost free lines at the campsites so we're actually so we are actually hooking up at that house over there um and that's our closest resource for water so it takes usually about 30 40 minutes to fill our tanks and then once that's done we'll leave the water on the rest of the day i get my dishes done take a couple showers and enjoy having free flowing water for a time Today we want to talk to you about blowing out your water lines and some of the attachments you can get to keep your water out of your hose so they will not freeze in the winter time. And that's an issue in the winter. So we fill our water tanks and we fill them with a hose. And then when we're done filling, we take and put this on whatever end we need to blow out and they work great. You blow them out, no water, no freeze. Store the hoses away in the tent and you'll be ready to go again next time. We needed 200 foot of hose, so a heated hose was not a good option for us. And then here's the compressor we keep in a garbage can. We keep the hose, everything dry in there, and we keep our extension cord nearby. We plug it in, and these have the fitting for your compressor, that attaches right into here. And of course that would go on your female under your hose. And if you're on the other end, that would be for the male under the hose. So we'll give a little demonstration later on how this works. Another product we find very useful is these little bendable rubber coated wire ties for doing up your hose and I can hang them in the tent back there. But uh, you just wrap it around the pole and one twist and you know you're good, they're hanging. Mm -hmm. 